So it, during the keynote today, Microsoft announced a new, it's basically a certification called the Microsoft uh, Pro Professional Degree, right? Uh, and what this is, is a, a kind of a, a program to allow people to gain certification by taking online classes and doing some hands-on labs. Uh, they've got to deal with edX, I think it is, um, to kind of run this for them. And you pay for different modules that you take. I, th I think it's interesting. Um, the, first, the first modules are, are all around data science. So if you want to learn how to be a data scientist, Microsoft went out, talked to people who are data scientists. They talked to companies that are in the space. They came up with a set of core skills that they think people need to know. And then they devised a bunch of courses for you to take. And they, they said today during the keynote that they think people could t complete this kind of a certification in four months, yeah. which is pretty amazing. I, yeah, I mean, I, th I yeah. think this is the tip of the iceberg because I, Me I too. briefly mentioned this Android nano degree thing, which mm -hmm. is actually a program that Google does with Udacity, right? So mm -hmm. um, this type of degree, for lack of a better term, is gaining in acceptability. And I think there's going to be a lot of this kind of stuff. In fact, I wondered at the time when I started looking into this why Microsoft didn't have something like this for C Sharp, Xamarin, whatever. And I bet they will. I bet Me within too. the next year they will. I think this is uh, going to be a huge uh, change. Right. Right now it's just in beta. They're calling yeah. it beta because yeah. it's just. The I think first it's going to explode. Test. I think this yeah. is really big. So if you do, if you want to check it out, um, I've got a blog post about it, and you can go in and uh, sign up now. Give them your email to get more information and to be part of the next class that opens up. Right now, they the people who are in the class that's graduating in September have been in this private pilot, but they're going to open it up to more people. So. <laughs> It's, it's, it's worth going and checking that out if, if you think that might be something you want to do. It, it reminded me, though, of uh, like a few years ago when my, Microsoft killed that whole master's certification that they had. Right. And um, at the time, they just said, you know what, we're trying to figure out what to do with our, our certification and learning platforms. And it might take us a while, but we're going to make it more consistent. Um, well, so it's going to map, I think, more closely to the way things are too. today in the world. Same. I think that's the important thing. So. Yeah. Whether it's uh, reimagining or how they describe it, you know, the the sales and marketing part of Microsoft when Kevin Turner left, or yeah. um, the certification program, it's going to map to the way things are. I yeah. think it's it's going to be big. So you know, the one thing uh, somebody asked me, and I don't know the answer, is how does uh, Lynda.com going to fit in here? Because yeah. Microsoft probably when they were building this hadn't yet bought LinkedIn, and Lynda is part of LinkedIn. So uh, a lot of people are saying, well, are they going to integrate Lynda with this, or yeah. is, is Lynda going to replace the thing that they built already? And so we, we don't know that. I don't even know if Microsoft Yeah, but Lynda.com is an example of this type of thing. Right, you know, Because is. when the Microsoft certification started, whenever that was 20 years ago or whatever, mm -hmm. um, you know, you'd go to a room and, and sit in a crowd and you'd, yeah. the guy would talk and you'd yeah. have a book and you'd do homework. Mm -hmm. And, you know, that was the way things were, but it's a different, you know, it's a different world now. Yeah.